Now they are crispy, golden. You can dip them, top them with bacon or cheese. They come in sweet potato, crinkle cut. You can season them with Cajun spices. It's National French Fry Day, and yeah. I think Abby has brought every possible yes, I think I, so. you know, we got combination of fries here with us in studio. Abby, always good to see you. Yes. Yeah, it's so good to be here and on National Friday. Yes. I mean, without the national, it's like happy Friday. It's not not it's not Friday. It's I Wednesday, know. but it's we Wednesday. are going to celebrate with some fries. Yes. Um, you can see how I made a charcuterie board with fries. Which I, I know. love that. And so dips. Fun. And dips. We've got ranch, ketchup, spicy ketchup, barbecue sauce, honey mustard. Super fun. Mm. Um, but I was going to show you if you wanted to kind of test your expertise in the kitchen, okay. Okay. you can Challenge make accepted. homemade <laughs> fries. Let's do it. Taking recipe potatoes, all you're going to do is cut them up. You don't have to skin them. I prefer okay. a skinned potato, but you don't have to. Okay. And then you're going to cut them up into little slices. Now, you do not want to forget these next two steps. Okay. Okay. The next step is you are going to let them soak in water. You can let them soak up to an hour. So 15 minutes up to an hour okay. really gets the starch off so that the oil um, that you're going to kind of drizzle on right. them, that olive oil is going to really stick to the fry okay. and make okay. it a little bit crispier. That's a great okay. step. But after you soak them in water, you're going to want to pat them off. Okay. okay. After you pat them off, you are going to pop them right back so these, in. So these have been pre-patted. These have been pre-patted. Okay. That's right. Got and then it. you're going to take that little olive oil right there. Okay. And then I'm going to get this seasoning for you. You can yes. mix that up. You're just going to drizzle that right All on this top. Together? All that together. Okay. So it's a tablespoon of parsley, garlic salt. You can do onion powder, paprika. If you want them a little bit spicier, you can substitute chipotle chili powder mm. for the paprika. It gives it okay. a little bit more zest. What do I do? Just dump. And you're just going to sprinkle How that. On. How much? You are going to, for one potato, this is half. So this uh, mixture, one tablespoon of each of those, will be two potatoes. We've okay. got one in here, okay. so about half of that mixture. Okay, half oh, of yeah. the mixture. Wow, look at that. Okay, got mm. it. Just sprinkle it over sprinkle on top. Away. Yeah, it smells great it's too. And then we're going to so take. Good. I'm going to squeeze around you. We're going to take okay. these tongs, and you are just going to okay. uh, shuffle them up in there. Make sure they're really well coated, and they are going to go straight in the air fryer, just like that yes 10 to 12 minutes That's your it? air fryer might take a little bit longer okay. Okay. depending on the power of the air fryer. <laughs> the power of the fryer. <laughs> nice but hey, can we just there. take a minute and love on the air fryer? Like, I know, come on. You can do <laughs> right. just about anything My with an air fryer. My kitchen is so different with an air fryer in it. Okay, you. one little last tip. We were talking about this before the segment. There is a spice called za'atar, and it is a Mediterranean spice. Yes. It is amazing. You can dip or, or powder, sprinkle this over your fry once they're cooked, before they're cooked. Mm. Super tasty. Dip them in tzatziki sauce. Amazing. These Super are so tasty. good. I know Abby asked us yesterday to do, um, you did a poll. Yes. <laughs> on your Instagram about your favorite dipping sauce, because I love ketchup. Jason does too. I do. I also love spicy ketchup, but also Jason said honey mustard. I did. I threw in some honey mustard because, yeah, of course, Jackie went with the traditional ketchup, so I had to think of like the second, second, maybe I would go with honey Nobody mustard. really enjoyed the honey mustard. Was I the only <laughs> one? I was the only one voting for honey mustard. <laughs> That's okay. You, you had you had some cohorts there. You had some people that, I, that agreed. Did. I'm surprised ranch dressing is that high. I shouldn't be, but I am for some yeah. reason. Ranch dressing is very high, but I will also dip in like um, a Thousand Island oh, base. Oh, yes. yeah. Mixed with something, I'll also do that. And I had some write-in answers for, for aioli. So herb aioli, yes. those kind of things. Mm -hmm. um, I was kind of shocked, but hey, who doesn't love a mayo-based dip? Right, <laughs> That's right. what aioli is, really. It's just yeah, kind of like a just, fancy mayo. It's mayo with some herbs. <laughs> And you say aioli and you sound fancy, yeah. right? I'm going to yes. dip my french fries in aioli. aioli. I know. Well, thank you for fancifying yes, thank you, Abby. today. Yeah. It's, it smells delicious. Which is that one? Is that bar barbecue, barbecue sauce? sauce. Oh, yeah. that's good stuff. Thank mm -hmm. you again. We appreciate it. <laughs> Happy we'll get, National Friday. We're going to be dipping all day long. We are. All day on Wednesday slash Friday. <laughs>